Hello YouTubers, Paul here, your channel host, welcome to my channel. Well you may remember um fortnight ago when I last did my proper uploads to my channel. Um the, one of the videos that I did or one of the vlogs that I did was um the vlog on the type of equipment that I use for my YouTube channel. And somebody commented on that video and Inid or Enid Ofty, I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong, and suggested that I, um if you're watching this, hi Enid or Inid. Um, and suggested that I do a, a vlog on the editing software that I use for my uh, YouTube videos. So I thought, well, yeah, noted, and <clears throat> this is the that exact video. So um, the first vid the first um, editing software that I use because I mainly use Android. Um, so the the first software I use on Android is called um, KK Movie Maker, and this is what it looks like. Yeah, so with KK Movie Maker, what I tend to use that for is it's, as you can see, it splices the videos together and it, you also can write on the videos. So what I tend to do is I import pictures from my phone onto the timeline and um, write titles and export it as a video and use those as the titles. So when you see me like that at the end of the videos or at the beginning with Welcome to my channel, Paul C. First, um, they have been created on KK Movie Maker. Right, the next edit the software that I use is called VidTrim, and VidTrim looks like this. Yeah, so again, VidTrim is just a simple uh, um, uh, um, software that I use on my phone from Android um, again and what it is is just a splice thing you you import the videos that you want to um, splice together and um, if you want to trim them I've never trimmed them actually on vid trim would you believe it I just use it as a splice thing I, I get the videos that are already cut ready splice them together and then export them as one video most a lot of my videos are done like that so say I add the, add the title, the opening and closing bit of me, you know, like the opening bit of my channel and the closing bit and then the video in between or the videos in between, depending on how many videos I've taken and export it like that. Symbols. Um, and the final um, app that I use on, uh, the final app that I use on um, Android is a bit more complicated. It's called um power director and this is what it looks like yeah so that's what power director looks like so basically if you've got a timeline and you can create um videos um what i tend to do say if i've recorded a video say on my phone directly and i can't get it to cut directly at the point that i need to what i can do is i can import it into power director and then what power director enables you to do is it enables you to cut chunks out of the videos and um, it enables you to add photographs on so you can say you've got a a whole video right and you just want to get a tiny little section out of the middle bit you can actually do that on power director excellent i definitely recommend it i use the the version where you've got the watermark which i'm not fussed about um but you can buy one where the 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 um watermark is removed but it doesn't bother me either way um yeah so it does what it does on the tin um right the final one that i use is if i'm uh, uploading from directly from the iPhone I use capture and it looks like this So 
So capture is basically um, a bit like vid trim on Android. You import the videos at, and then you splice it all together and export it. It saves on the, the camera roll on your on your i on your iPhone, and then you yeah, just upload it from there onto uh, YouTube. What could be simpler, eh? Anyway, that's what I use. That's the mate the. Uh, that's the four main apps that I use for me uh, uploading my videos. Hope you've enjoyed this quick video, and see you in the next one, YouTubers.